It is definitely a morning where you want to warm the car up. Not only do we have temperatures that are into the 20s, but we saw that little bit of snow through the overnight. Right now it is 28 degrees in Lansing, Charlotte and Jackson, so it's still possible that we see some refreezing on the roadways. Just use a little bit of caution as you're out and about this morning. Now it looks like things will be getting even cooler as we go into the morning hours tomorrow. Right now they're sitting into the scenes and single digits across the western UP and parts of Wisconsin. I don't know that we quite hit the single digits, but the teens are a real possibility about this time tomorrow. As we check out your planner for today, it's really not showing much of a warm up. We're only getting those temperatures back into the low 30s for your highs. A lot of cloud cover around for today and we even see the occasional snow flurry or two, although most of that activity, as you can tell, will be back near Lake Michigan. The lake effect machine really just kicking on through today, only giving us a couple light snow flurries here in the Lansing and Jackson area. But the bigger weather story as we go through the next couple of days will finally be some high pressure setting into the Great Lakes. And that means we finally see some sunshine does not warm us up a whole lot. We'll only get those highs into the 40s by the end of the week. Future track, it is wanting to show some clearing as we go throughout the day today. I still think we hold on to a considerable amount of cloud cover. Notice the lake effect snow showers over in the west and southwest corner of the state. I really think that's where they see the biggest concerns as far as snow is concerned today, but we could still deal with the occasional flurry through the day. Heading into the overnight tonight, we finally see that high pressure moving into our area, so we should at least see the clouds break apart a little bit tonight. Heading into Wednesday, we do have a lot of sunshine to look forward to. Should be a very nice looking day. We're just not warming up a whole lot on Wednesday. Part of that is due to that very chilly start to our day on Wednesday where we are into the upper teens. We end up topping out only in the mid 30s on Wednesday, but it looks like the sunshine will be holding on all the way into Thursday and by Thursday, we get those high temperatures closer to the 40 degree mark. But today it's a struggle to get above freezing. We top out only around 32 degrees, mostly cloudy skies today, just the occasional snow flurry or two, but no more accumulation is expected today. Through the overnight tonight, lows dipping into the upper teens. It is a partly cloudy night. Clouds start to break up a little bit more as we get towards your day on Wednesday. And Wednesday should end up being a, a very nice looking day. Mostly sunny skies, just definitely on the chilly side. We get those high temperatures tomorrow only up to around 34 degrees. Now as we get into Thursday and Friday, we do see a little bit of a warm up. Still these temperatures well below average. We top out right around 40 on Thursday with mostly sunny skies for the opening day of firearm deer season. Friday for silver bells in the city. Mostly cloudy skies and it's looking like we should be dry. Notice we've shifted that system into the weekend. Looks like yeah. Saturdays are better <laughs> chances of seeing any rain or snow. Temperatures also take a little bit of a dip as we head into the weekend. Back into the 30s for your highs and looks like we'll stay in the 30s for your highs at least for the start of next week. Once we get past Thanksgiving though, there are some early indications there might be a little bit of a warm up. Will that be something to be thankful for? That would be something to be thankful <laughs> for. Although there's plenty of people that are thankful for the snow, you know. The yeah. resorts up north are already starting to blow some snow. They could have an early run this year. Yeah, that's true. And they've gotten a lot more than we have. Oh, already. they certainly have. Yeah. All right. Thank you, sir.